Hi everyone, I'm Tongi, Product Manager at Kailabs, and I'm very glad to welcome you to this last episode of the second season of Kailabs Academy dedicated to space division multiplexing. In the first episodes, we explained what space division multiplexing is. In this last one, we are going to present our unique special mod multiplexer, the MPLC. If you already know Kylabs, you probably noticed that we like to shape light. Indeed, we prove our ability to transform any kind of motion beam in whatever we want thanks to our multiplane light conversion technology. For people who don't know this technology, MPLC is a technique patented by Kylabs that allows performing any unitary spatial transform. Theoretically, any unitary spatial transform can be implemented by a succession of transverse phase profiles separated by optical Fourier transforms, OFT. In particular, the conversion of n separate input motion beams into n orthogonal propagation modes of a fiber, that is spatial multiplexing, can be considered as a unitary spatial transform and therefore can be achieved with the MPLC. To reduce the footprint of the MPLC and the losses, as well as decrease the complexity of aligning free space optical elements, the MPLC is in practice implemented using a multipass cavity in which the succession phase profiles are all printed on a single reflective phase plate. The cavity is formed by a miro and the reflective phase plate, implementing the successive phase profiles and optical transforms. Our special mode multiplexer includes this technology and we have a range of products designed for that, the Proteus product line. For the past few years, many research groups have worked with Proteus multiplexers and we have demonstrated our ability to work with many kinds of fiber. Standard multimode fibers, few mode fibers, with many kinds of architectures, graded X1, step index one, or weaker one. We have also validated mod group multiplexing using the same technology in field trials for high capacity transmission in legacy fiber infrastructures, like hospital, university, enterprise, or campus, for example. In 2017, a research group from KDDI Lab used Proteus multiplexers to realize the world record for bandwidth into a fiber, 10 petabit per second for an optical fiber link. Today, we are proud to offer the best product on the market, which offers up to 45 special mods selectively, multiplexed and excited, unparalleled optical performances and record model selectivity. This special mod multiplexer is polarization insensitive. It's simple to integrate with low optical losses and compatible with a wide range of frequencies. Finally, I want to thank you very much for watching this episode. We hope you enjoyed watching it too. But don't worry, it's not the end. After these two seasons, a new one is coming soon with a brand new topic related to beam shaping. So goodbye and see you soon.